I'm going to show you how to fix victory road problem so make sure to follow my steps first of all all you have to do is to go to the windows taskbar right click on any empty space and select task manager now once you get here go to the search and type in the launcher that you have the game on for example steam and then if you do find it running as a process in the background make sure to terminate it so right click on it and select end task now once done go to the windows icon and then search for settings once you get here again go to windows update and then select download and install all if you do have any stack updates go to update history deselect the first two and then select recovery follow up with the first option and then select other troubleshooters you can try run and see if the problem is going to fix otherwise go back and select it install now instead the next method go to the search and type in device manager and open this and then make sure to look for the display adapters elements and click on the side arrow now click on your graphics card either amd or nvidia right click and select update driver select search automatically for drivers and then click on close now all you have to do is to relaunch the steam launcher once again you'll be redirected to the store of course so go to the view option go to the top left corner and select the steam logo select check for steam client updates to ensure that you have the newest version after that go to settings from here you need to go to storage and select the drive that you have your game on now click on these three dots and then select repair library for the next step go to downloads and make sure to select the clear cache button after that click on confirm now once done go to the view option and select library now in the left menu you search for your installed game after that click on this gear icon and select properties from here select install files after that select verify integrity of game files you need to wait for the process to finish it is very important so it verifies that you have all the original and important game otherwise it will be recovering and restoring the missing files now once done you should just go reset your computer and try again and hopefully the problem is gone if you do find it helpful consider subscribing and see you on the next one